Hello, welcome to today's immigration tidbit. Well, there's not an exact uh, set of documents for every case. Okay? Lots of cases are different and have different issues. So the first thing that I would need to know is why is your daughter not with you? Why did you come in but not your daughter? Then I'd need to know how did you come in? How did you get the green card? And then how did you get the U.S. citizen or were you born here? And then I'd need to know where's the father of this child? I need to know if this is a child or if it is uh, a girl that is over 21 years of age. I need to know if she's single or married. And I need to know if you filed anything ever before. So by doing that, I would look at the visa waiting chart. I'd look at the possibility of derivative citizenship. I'd look at it to see if there's any issue with what immigration could look at as fraud. So for example, if you came in and your daughter could have come in with you, um, and now it's you know 10 years later, and all of a sudden you want to bring your daughter in, immigration will not believe that she's your daughter. Okay, She's going to believe you're trying to get somebody else in who's not your daughter. So it may require a DNA test to prove that you're the biological mother. Uh, and then I I'm assuming that you're the mother if uh, if you're the father, uh, then uh, that means that there's another added issue, it, it, depending how old your daughter is. Did you raise her? Did you pay money to, to help with her school, her medical? Did you see her often? Because there's a legitimation issue. Um, and this also depends if you're married to the mother or not. Uh, you know, whereas the mother does not have to prove legitimation, the father does. And if you, in fact, for example, uh, know that this is your daughter, if you're a man, if you know that this is your daughter, and, you know, it's been 16 years and or 17 years, and they're going, well, now I think I'm going to petition her, it's not quite that easy. If legitimation has not been proven, you cannot petition her. Okay? It doesn't matter. Uh, so there are serious issues um, in regards to that. So when you ask what documentation do you need to fill out? Uh, there's a lot of other issues that we need to look at to determine uh, what issues exist and so forth. I, I'd also need to know if you have any criminal history. I need to determine if a Walsh waiver is necessary. I need to know if she has a criminal history. I'd also need to know if she's been to the U.S. before or if she was deported or if she has uh, criminal history or inadmissible on any particular ground. So those are just a few of the things I need to look at to determine what needs to be done, okay?